Welcome back, everybody. I know it's been a few days, but we have a lot to talk about in a short amount of time. Uh, thank you, everybody who watched the video on uh, the Bitcoin master plan. This has been a uh, thanks to let's thank Master Kenobi first. His Twitter is going to be in his Twitter handle is going to be in the description below. Um, this kind of master plan has been around for a bit. There has been speculation that I mean we've always known. The, the people that have been in the know, the people that have made money in this market who understand that the markets, all the markets, crypto, stocks, bonds, you name it, they're all they all go in cycles and Bitcoins happen to go in four year cycles. And uh, here we are. We're halfway between the second one. Um, you can watch the past video talking about that. Uh, it looks like we should have a bottom coming in a few days. But what we really want to discuss is what's currently going on in the market now if, if the last chart was to be believed if we're saying that we are repeating this cycle here not every pattern is the same while this was a a very obvious descending wedge that went down from 20k down to 3100 um then this pattern from from here to here is something very similar similar but at a different angle the angles are always they're always they're never going to be the same they're never going to be exact don't expect that it's not we're not going to have it look exactly like this or exactly like this it does look more like this uh back in 2014 2015 but we should be expecting lows sometime in november uh we have the uh we have news coming out november 2nd uh in regards to uh inflation and I'm guessing that's going to precede the uh, the midterm elections and it will it won't look good for the economy uh, during that time. But I think we will hit our lows sometimes in November, sometime in November. And if you look at the chart here, that's what we're looking for uh, sometime early November. November 2nd is when that information comes out. Um, but if this if that charts to be believed, then uh, we're ha we're still looking for this certain type of pattern to play out from here to here we have a big breakdown in terms of where we're at now we're looking for yeah this might look similar to that which is what i was thinking but in terms of the time frame we're not uh, it doesn't match up okay um so we should see something lower somewhere down uh, back down to the previous six, uh, 65 percent Fibonacci or the 618 Fibonacci somewhere, in my opinion, uh, somewhere between 13,500 and 14,000. At worst, we could see somewhere between 12,500, which is what Master Kenobi was saying in the plan. And again, we're trying to keep this quick. Um, so we're going to zoom in to what's happening right now um, to keep an update. Again, remember, we're not just saying, oh, buy now, unload all your savings into Bitcoin right now or crypto right now at, at 18, 19, 20 K. We're saying wait for the next big dip. This what happened this weekend with the, uh, the CPI data, uh, which is the inflation data came out and it was point zero four percent worse than expected. So it was worse than expected. So the market stock market. Crypto market, bonds market, equities market uh, took a crash prior to the data during the data. And then we had a full reversal almost back to the uh, back to a major trend line. And then now we're it looks like we're reversing again um, and currently going into the weekend. This is the range I expect to go somewhere between 19,000, uh, 19,400 all the way down to 18,000, uh, uh, 800, 900 somewhere in between there we could also hit a low at 18,500 uh somewhere around there um so those are the expectations don't expect a lot to happen don't expect a lot to happen during this time um keep your money safe keep stacking up because guess what we got look back at the at the bitcoin master plan and obviously we haven't hit 12,500 yet and we haven't hit 82% down. Right now we're currently 70, uh, 75% down from the $69,000 all uh, $69, all-time high. We also have the Bitcoin halving coming in April 2024. So keep in mind you have 
what a year and three year and four months year and five months to get your money straight get your life straight get your money straight figure out how you're gonna make this work stop drinking Starbucks coffees you know we always use that example um, I don't know figure it out you, you, you know do uber eats become an uber eats driver become an uber driver lyft driver do something on the side times are gonna get rough we're going into we're we're already in a recession but we're gonna be going into an official recession sometime after november um as i've mentioned before i believe the black swan event or maybe i haven't i mentioned on my group black swan event will possibly be the recognition of the u.s government and the world governments finally admitting that we are in a recession sometime between november and, and january november and february um the markets will finally take the much needed breather um much take a much needed breather and we will have the opportunity to stack up every time you see big dips in the market and the news is talking about oh did you see or news is uh talking about how how red the market is and your friends are saying oh did you see how far bitcoin dipped as soon as your friends say oh bitcoin's dead crypto's dead buy as much as you can there will be a reversal that's how market psychology works as soon as as soon as the 95 percent of us 95 percent who lose money in the market uh, think that something is dead it's time to buy that's how market psychology works and it hopefully it will be somewhere around 12,000 13 14,000 keep that in mind um, stay afloat stay alive survive um, don't worry about all this choppiness during the next week we can even go back up to 21k we can go back up to 21k and then come back down we can go to 22k ultimately we have to fill back down to somewhere between 13 and 17k under under the major trend lines all right so that's all i have for you today wanted to keep that short and informative i'll try to keep up i'll try to keep updates coming uh every week uh major updates once a month regarding the big master plan that we have here keep studying it look at it study it understand it ask questions join the discord come in ask questions uh, if you're in nfts we're big in nfts right now we believe nfts are sort of like bonds uh, they're gonna hold whether you're into Solana or nft or, or ethereum nfts your your big time nfts the ones that matter the ones that are building uh, on web 3.0 platform uh, they will they will hold their their Solana or ethereum value over time even if the USD value is dropping then once the bull market comes back then your money your investment will hold its value and even go up from there so keep that in mind um, we talk about nfts there all the time a uh, membership will be built very soon maybe mid uh, mid October to end of October. So keep a lookout for that. Something you'll be able to learn, sink your teeth into during um, the what I will be calling the Bitcoin crab market, the sideways market that we'll be experiencing somewhere around here for the next year or so. All right. So uh, look for the links below for Twitter, Discord, anything else. If you need wallets, they will be below as well thanks for tuning in and we're gonna stop there if you have any questions shoot the questions below thanks